everybody, welcome back to Smell Good Phrase Reviews. Coming at you with another scent by Navicus Parfums. This is Virtus. All right, so let's crank this thing open. Oh, look at that. We lost the card. Sits in there nice. Looks very pretty. Great presentation. Got this little card. Which is pretty cool. Has the notes on the back so I don't have to guess them. I can just cheat and read them. Yeah. All right. So let's get this bad boy out. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right. So here's the bottle. Very nice. On the back of it. Says some stuff. All right. Says hand crafted fragrance, romantic, mysterious, enigmatic. Enigmatic. English. Not doing that good with it lately. Oh, it smells so good. All right. So before I, uh, Look at this. This is good. And it's using a note that I do not like, which is surprising. All right. I came. I saw. I conquered. Top notes. Bergamot, cardamom, devania, nutmeg, and saffron. Heart notes. It's honey, beeswax, absolute, mango, fig milk, cinnamon, clary sage, tobacco, in the base, patchouli, vanilla, labnum, absolute, musk, ambergris, benzoin, and driftwood. Perfumer was Bertrand Duchefour. 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 Bert Douche. It smells really good. I get like, it's probably like a bunch of scents it gets together, but I kind of pick up on, on like an iris note, like lipstick. A little bit, but it's not bad. So it's probably why I got lulled into saying this smells good. So it's just a combination, probably the beeswax and stuff, I imagine. Because lipstick's very waxy. But it's got a really good scent to it. It's very pleasant. I like it. It's very good. And again, it comes in a super cool bottle. All his bottles look the same. I buy the, the 50 mils. So unfortunately, there'll be no giveaway uh, because I'm hanging on to these because you don't know how long these guys will stay in business. They discontinue the scents. And with the decants that I give away, it literally takes away a quarter of this bottle. Sorry? You know, it's one of those things like when you deal with a small company, like when I get something from Dior, I can be like, hey man, can you give me some samples or like a discount on the bottle or whatever so anything to help so i can give to my subscribers a lot of times i get declined but a bunch of times they're like yeah hey you know we'll take 20 percent off the bottle if you're going to be giving away uh, a 10 mil decant so a lot of these companies do some pretty cool stuff being a small company that's just starting out they don't really have that option and i'm not a very large youtuber either i only have like 200 subscribers so i'm kind of nobody so getting stuff given to me to give away to you is a little difficult to ask for. Oh, this is really good. This is good. You wear this out on a date. Ah, oh, the woman's just going to love the way you smell. There. It's really good stuff. Anyway, real quick review this time. Someone said I've been taking too long on my reviews, so I'm trying to... Get in and get out. It's very cool. If you're seeing me for the first time, please uh, do me a solid, man. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and shit, you know? Why? If I can get bigger, companies will be like, oh, yeah, let's make sure this guy has some stuff. They give stuff to me. I give stuff to you. That's how it works. Sometimes I get a big enough bottle and I'm just like, ah, you know what? I don't mind giving away a 10 mil decant. But on these little ones here, I, uh, nope, keeping them for myself, man. <laughs> Navitus Parfums, 
All right, this is Virtus. It's very good. The bottle definitely covers the smell of it, which is fantastic. So go put your own nose on it. Do not take my word for it. Uh, Steven's killing it. I know a lot of people say, ah, oh, they're just clones of really expensive stuff and they're charging a little less than expensive. Well, one, these are expensive. Two, all colognes kind of in perfumes nowadays, kind of you can pick out like some similarities to something else. Doesn't mean that the perfumers aren't being creative and finding ways to uh, take the scent DNA they come up with, which might be loosely based on or be assimilated with somebody else's stuff and can make it better. Like Aventus, my bottle of Aventus, I don't even use it. It's there for looks at this point. And uh, the stuff, other band, brands make stuff that's very comparable to it, that outperform it, and to me smell a little bit better. So thank God people have stuff that smells sort of similar because this might not be for you, but this is. But anyway, definitely check out Navitus Parfums. Give these guys a chance. It's good stuff, high quality. The note breakdowns are stupid close to what you're getting. Like I said, I don't know what gives it that lipstick smell. I'm going to go with it's got to be the combination of the honey we, honey and the beeswax. Primarily the beeswax because it's a wax and lipstick is a wax. So that's probably why. Anyhow, there you go. I'll catch you in the next video. My name is Sean. I like to smell good. I like to let you know how that's possible for you to do so using tons of this stuff. Catch you next video. Later.